My father had passed away my junior year. We had no money. My mother had to um, had her own financial issues. Uh, dad didn't leave us in the best of financial straits. Uh, I knew financially the only way I was going to college was on a music scholarship. Um, that was I was a pretty good French horn player. So, and I knew I wanted to study politics. That was, I'd had that in my head. I went specifically looking for schools that allowed for a double major of music and political science, so meaning that they would be in the same school. Did you have to try out with a French horn audition mm -hmm. to get in? Oh yeah, you audition, yeah. Do you remember the piece you auditioned with? Yeah, it's called Villa Villanelle. This just became my go-to, it was my, what I did for senior competition in the state of Florida for music. It was just a piece that, it, it was, you know, a way to show off range. It was kind of neat. GW really recruited me. GW was like, music department really, really, and they just found more scholarship money. Some of it had to do with the pet band. I had to agree to be in the pet band, go to all the games, but you got essentially paid for it. There was another extra 3,500. In touring GW, you felt like it was the only university that was in Washington. I didn't feel like Georgetown was in the city. I didn't feel like AU was in the city, and certainly didn't think George Mason. And so it was a combination of that. It was sort of like the finances combined with where I wanted to be. Um, it all came together and it was GW. So let's talk about senior year of college. You did not complete the full senior year. I didn't. I started working full time two years into college. I started at something called the Hotline, which I ended up working on and off in for the last 15, for about 15 years. But I would basically go to school around my work schedule. Probably in hindsight, not the advice I would give somebody. Instead of your, you should put your work schedule around your college. I am short to um, two classes that have nothing to do with my degree, have nothing to do with either music or political science. It's just the, the, the stuff you're supposed to do that I, like, oh, I'm not gonna bother with calculus this cycle. I'm not gonna bother with rocks for jacks. Now I'll wait next semester, next semester, next semester. Then all of a sudden you're out of money. You're out of scholarship and I still had six more credits. Now part of the problem is I was a double major. I have like some absurd amount of credits, more than you need, just not the right ones you need to have. Go visit all the schools, and just remember, they need you more than you need them. Do not get into this situation where you think you need them. If you've got multiple schools that you've gotten into, you have the leverage. Mm -hmm.